Good evening everybody, this is Celtics A4 2 this is part 18, let's play LA Noir. Last time we left off, we just finished up the, the Golden Butterfly case, and we arrested Eli Rooney for the murder, and now we're starting a new case called the Silk Stocking Murder. Oh, this ain't good. This ain't fucking good. Ah, oh, fellas. I was just discussing with Finn Bar here how well he was doing. Have a seat. Yeah, I'm, I might be. I'm gonna be able. I'm gonna be able to not recording. And yes, this is gonna be a painful editing once again because what he said. There's another naked woman we gotta we gotta deal with. God damn it, Rockstar. More editing for me. Don't you just love it? So what you guys been up to? Today is May the 25th. Well, in one in one hour away, it's gonna be, it's gonna be May the 26th. Also, Yoshi Gamer Girl's birthday is tomorrow. We should go. We should wish her wish her wish her a happy birthday. So if uh, Yoshi Gamer Girl's birthday is tomorrow, which means that my part one of Let's Play Sonic 4 Episode 2 is gonna be a year old, because I did start a Let's Play on her birthday. So now we gotta go to a crime scene and deal with that naked lady. God damn it, I'm so sick and tired of dealing with naked ladies. Let me find out that Rockstar is a pervert. And so yeah, the reason why I'm so late recording because well it's only because I went to the mall this morning and I bought God of War, the uh, the assassin. I can't pronounce that A word, but it's the newest God of War. Which is a prequel to God of War 1, 2, and 3. And I also bought Girls Season 1 on DVD. God damn it. See, this is why I try to drive my... This, this, is, this is why I, I, do, I do my best to drive carefully while he's talking. That kind of upset me. Well, god damn, dude! Y'all drive too goddamn fast. Yeah, I'm probably, probably not gonna get it. Probably ain't fucked up the five star alre already. I ain't that surprised, man. Alright. Now we're at the crime scene. I s oh, we're not. Oh, come on, man. I'm right there. Stop trying to bullshit me, game. Alright, now we're at the crime scene. So prepare to see a dark screen in a few minutes. Ready to start the show. I'll take you through. All right. Oh, there's a bare feet. Oh man. God damn it. So now the screen is dark. All right. Now the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna extend the dead lady. But first, we're gonna um, check all her body, and this is one of these uh, red herring clues. But we're gonna check them out anyway, which is recommended. Let's let's, let's see what's on her, on her right hand. Oh, okay. Okay, I try to go on her. Oh man, can I go on her right hand? Fucking controllers. Man, her body must be stinking because there's like flies flying over her body. Alright. Now let's check her right hand. And she, she got some kind of ticket. Antonia. Alright. That's all. Evidence in the Muller case was solid. I'm not convinced about Mendes. The best way to get away with murder is to pin it on somebody else. I'll bet a month's salary this is a copy. Strangle, batter, Yeah, hey. yeah, yeah, we know the ammo. So does every jerk who kills his wife and girlfriend looking for a way out. I've spoken to Brown. He still believes that Dahlia Perp has medical experience. Four women, all murdered, all put on display, all with messages. No, there had no message. Look, pal, this is getting us nowhere. Anything for us to go on now? Yeah. Losing from a small man's shoe. Further I don't feel like doing a bunch of editing tonight, but I have to. Cause I didn't record anything this morning because I was out all day. 
And I've been playing Sonic uh, 06 all day. Right now I'm stuck at. So our first clue is that bloody um, what we call it? Yep, bloody stocking. Which is right here. Oh my god, good good luck playing this on the PC version because when the fun fact, when you get near a clue, the keyboard's not gonna vibrate. Alright, that's the second clue. Now follow the trail. And we should get to the third clue. Alright, yep, the hat. Alright, let's turn it around. Yep, ladies' hat. So that's her hat. So, the head north to the. All right, now we got to find find a trash can. All right, let's go north. We should see a trash can. Yep, there it is. And there should be another clue in there. No, that's a cup. That's a broken cup. Put that down. Take a look at this shoe. Ah. Proximity to the scene plus the blood stains. No way is this coincidence. Alright, then there's gonna be another blood trail. Alright. But that counts as a, a red herring clue. Alright. Now we gotta follow it. And it should lead us to our to our fifth clue. We kept the area pristine for you boys. Let's check it out. Alright. The fifth clue is right here. Alright, come on. Alright. Uh zoom in closer. Thank you. Strung up like bait on a hook. Okay. There's another clue up north. I think it's right here. Oh shit. Wait. Oh, I hit X. Oh wait, maybe there it is. There it is. There it is. I see it. This one I'm looking for. Forgot where it's at. All right, good. Yeah, I'm reading, I'm reading my notebook right now. All right. Then you want to climb up the ladder. Oh wait, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, when I have a hit X and and I ain't happening. Just want to show that off. Now we climb up the ladder for reals. Sorry, sorry for wasting time there. Now remember, when you go on fire escapes, just hold up. Don't just turn the joystick around, otherwise you're gonna keep going down the down the stairs. And now there's a few red or red herring clues here, like this one for example. All right, hit X. And the letter is empty. Where is all of this meant to be taking us? Alright. And I believe. Alright. There's another red herring clue. Enameled and gold plated. This was precious to her. It, 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 looks, it looks pretty precious to her. Now we got clump. Now we got clump another pole. Wait. Okay. Trail points up. Let's continue to follow the trail. Oh wow, that was a rare glitch. <laughs> you saw that? <laughs> he was walking, standing still. All right, what's in here? Hmm, another red her another red herring. I don't know if I pronounced that right. 
Alright, let's climb up. Oh, and there's something. This this is an updated clue. Come on. Looks as though the killer was decorating with this. Hmm, y'all. So that blood is actually paint. Hmm. This should be the last clue. Alright, so extra. And that should be the last clue of this area. Yep, that's half of that uh of that ticket. Yep, a library card. Alright. We should hear that music now. Alright. So now we're all ready to take us back to our police car. So now our next destination is Antonia's residence. So anyway, as I was saying about uh, Sonic 06, right now I'm at uh, Kingdom Valley, and oh my god, man, that fucking station is so fucking long, and it's tough. Now I'm dying like crazy. Oh, and to the guy, uh, and uh, I even posted my Skype status, that uh, how many uh, sections are there in, in uh, Kingdom Valley? If someone know, please do tell. Because the first I got to uh, Kingdom Valley was, I, I made it to that, to that all scrolling part where Sonic runs on his own, just like he was chasing the egg carrier at, the, at a wave ocean. So if, some, if somebody knows how many sections are there in uh, Kingdom Valley, if if someone know, please do tell, because I really want to, I really really want to beat Kingdom Valley, because that stage is so fucking boring and it's not fair. But yeah, I did post my Skype status and no one answered me. So I might as well be up on a recording until I finish this case. I may upload today's episode tonight, then I'll upload the next one like tomorrow. Alright, now we're at the residence. Alright, better activate cutscene. Oh yeah, because mostly it's going to take place in the girls' room, so first we're going to watch this little cutscene. Nice dicks! Into the house we go. Knock, knock, knock! Wait just a moment! Wait just a moment! <laughs> sorry. Hello, old lady. LAPD, ma'am. Detective Phelps and Galloway. Does Mrs. Maldonado live here? Yes, she does. I'm Mrs. Barbara LaPente, the owner of this boarding house. Barbara the son Oh, I can't pronounce her last name right, even though she just fucking said it. Somewhere we can discuss this. Of course. Follow me through to the party. All right. Drop your feet if you come in, detectives. But we didn't. So first, we're just going to talk to her. Then we're going we're gonna to search for, for, for some more clues. I kind of like her acting in this one. It sounds like she's not that surprised that she that uh that was her face died. Yeah, Antonia. That's her name, Antonia. God damn, I can't I can't think of her name completely. So now we gotta go upstairs to her room. All right. That's right. Lead the way, uh, Rusty, because you are main hero. All right. Now up the stairs we go. Got a big old house there. All right. Sorry about my computer screen being all dark. Oh wait, the room's probably this way. Yep, this is it. Now I believe the first clue is right here. The first two clue. Yup. The iron picket and the broken window. 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 What if I, where did I get that from? Let's right, take a look at the stick. Alright, come on. So 
someone broke in using this thing instead of a crowbar. I wonder where it was taken from. Alright. Now we gotta go back to her bed. It should be a suitcase. If I can get it, if I can, if I can get back in the window. All right, let's take a look at that mail. Hit X to open it. All right, y'all can read this to yourself, but I'm just gonna activate the clue. All right, and that's their attorney's letter. So apparently, this is the this is the force papers. I should play that music now. Oh, here is more. All right, let's see. Oh, okay, okay, okay. On your left, there should be a picture frame. Thank God, I took notes in my in my notebook. Charm bracelet wasn't among the crime scene evidence. Hmm. His wife. All right. So that's all the clues. Now it's time to go go interview uh what's her name? Barbara Libertino. <laughs> I'll call her Libertino because I can't pronounce her last name. Alright. God, what, what Okay, now I'm getting lost in her house. I believe it's this way. Yep, it's this way. You have some questions, ma'am, if you're up to it. Yes, Mr. I'll do my best. All right, possible suspects, get ready. Any idea who might have wanted to hurt Mrs. Maldonado? That rat of her husband, Angel. She was serving him divorce papers. If I killed every wife to serve me papers, I'd be a mass murderer. <laughs> Are you being flippant, young man? No, ma'am. Smart ass. <laughs> Truth. What can you tell us about Angel Maldonado? She married him when she was 17. He was cruel. Very cruel. She was a good girl. A little on the religious side, but a good girl. All right, movements of victim. What time did Antonia go out yesterday? She left around nine. Do you know where she went? No. It's doubt. She was a good girl, but she didn't confide in me. A nosy old hag like you knows everything about. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Phelps. <laughs> it's so fucking random, man. You went from you went from saying you fuck young boys to a noisy old hag. God damn it, Cole Phelps. <laughs> All right, evidence of break in. You had a break in? Yo, that can't be true. She might be a rabbit, but she's lying. Yeah, she doesn't, but it's the broken window. Alright, where's the broken window at? Um, where's the bro- Oh, God, I went right past it. Whew! So that was close. Iron bar to Jimmy the back I'm about to say, no, I know I found that fucking clue. Well, it's already out there, lady. Now, last question. Breakdown of marriage. Antonia and her husband were estranged? Yes. She moved here after she separated from her husband two months ago. But Antonia still wore a wedding ring? She wore the wedding ring and a necklace. She always wore a religious necklace. That one's a lie. That's about all of her jewelry. Well, lying, you lying old hack. What about her bracelet? Alright, charm bracelet. The one on the bottom. In her wedding photo, she's displaying a charm bracelet. That thing? She and we got a new clue. Key. Religious yeah. necklace. She always kept it in that wooden jewelry box. Thanks, ma'am. You've been very helpful. Pay a call to that husband of hers. Lock him up and throw away the key. We can either front change Alright, I'll be back for the next recording session. Alright, where's my car at? Oh, it's over there.
Alright, come on Rusty. Let's get this over with. But we're gonna do that in the next video. Alright, now, now, now next our next destination is Eldor Bar. El Dorado Bar. Sometimes you have to Alright guys, so next time let's play LA Noir, we're going we're going to uh, El Dorado Bar and see what's going on. So until next time, Celtics A42 out.